Thank you, Marty. You know, we've all got some kind of questionable data on our computers, and in my case, it's video footage of intern interviews, which may or may not be legal, but if the feds or our human resource department come a-knocking, I want it destroyed. So, uh, Kevin, yes. I have to ask you, is it possible to fully destroy data on a computer? It is indeed. In fact, I have my top six ways to destroy data for you tonight. First, this one is on the computer side. Most people think when you drag and drop a file to the recycling right. bin, it's gone. But in actuality, it's not gone. Just the header information has been removed. The file is still there on, on the hard drive. So this is some, uh, actually a file I want to get rid of here on the laptop. It's a picture of Marty. With his breakfast uh, is exposed. Yeah, I'm not really liking that one. So I, I installed a program called Eraser. And all I have to do is right click on here and then choose Erase. And once I select that, it's going to bring up a bunch of options here. What I'm going to choose is a 35 pass overwrite. And what that means is it's going to rewrite that information with random zeros and ones over and over and over again. So there's no possible way you can get that information back. The Department of Defense requires seven overwrites. We're going to do 35 just because that's not, you know, my kind of Marty. English. Yes, <laughs> exactly. Next one, this here is the Royal MD-100. This is going to be a CD shredder. So if you have some, you know, documents or something that you've burned to a CD you want to right. destroy, here, go ahead and give it a try. Just go ahead and drop that in there. And it's going to completely shred up the CD in the nice little tiny bits there. Does it cross cut it? Because that's very important. Yes. <laughs> yes, it does cross cut, as a matter of fact. And you can use this for like confetti. Well, you really shouldn't use it as confetti, actually. I shouldn't have said that. You know, but... people's OCD will try and put it back together. <laughs> yeah. They get these. Anyway. So that's, no uh, that's fun. It's about 100 bucks. Okay. Uh, Next thing. Eh. Go... Yeah, no, 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 too impressed eh. yet, huh? What else? This one. Uh, girlfriend's coming over, you know, you got to get it with some data really fast right. or the feds are knocking on the door. Throw it in the microwave. Yes, uh, if you only put it on for about 10 seconds, what's going to happen is, is the microwave is going to arc across the metallic surface, destroying the data. Right. Um, actually, I found if you have the uh, popcorn setting, uh, it does nice little bursts. Take a look inside here, inside the actual device, because you're going to see it sparking right away. So, let's see, there we go, yeah. Wow, that's pretty cool. So, yeah, that's, uh, and let's take a look inside. I think we just uh, it's smoking a little bit. Um, Our cameraman's going to pass out now. Yeah, so you can see the uh, little hot, actually, little hot. <laughs> um, yeah, so that, uh, that's completely uh, destroyed the disc there. See, it's nice and, and broken up there. No data is coming off of that disc. And Now, I, have a, I, I don't have a microwave. I just have a stovetop oven. What do I, does that come uh, 350 for about 10 minutes, put it in, you'll be fine. All right, what else do we have? This um, next scary. thing, this, this is what you got to put the gloves on. This is the little uh, cancer-causing agents here, just to let you know. Um, this here is actually some pool acid that we dip this drive in. Uh, muriatic acid. Muriatic acid, acid. Yeah. that's it. And actually, we have some footage here. Let's, uh, let's show. This was dipping the drive in the acid. If you notice, once the sun hits, it's going to start to boil a little bit here. And then uh, this little time lapse here, it's going to start to fizz up a little bit. It's, just, it's eating away at the aluminum is what it's doing right now, destroying all the data on the disk. And just to let you know, those fumes, you're not going to want to breathe those in. You're not going to want to breathe those are How long did that take? Films. What was the total time for uh, About two hours. And it's going to eat away at the heads and completely destroy the data on the disc. And the vapors irritate the respiratory tract. So watch out, yeah. people. Yeah, not people. good. Cancer-causing, stuff like that. Eh. Yeah, whatever. Next one is, uh, this one has been destroyed with some thermite that burns at 2,000 degrees Celsius. And that is basically, it's molten iron that, well, let, let's just take a look at the footage here. We actually, I set this up in my backyard, and uh, that's a pound of thermite. And the second you ignite it, there it goes, yeah. Now, that, that's molten iron spraying off of it. You want to step back for that one. Quick um, question, Kevin. What's your security deposit on that house? Yeah, neighbors, neighbors are not going to be a big fan of this one. It does the job, but neighbors don't like it. Um, one, now we have a new one tonight, an experiment. This one we're going to do liquid nitrogen like they did in Terminator 2. So it's possible, this, you, we haven't done this before we ever. We haven't done this before ever. This may is, or may not work. Yes, let's, uh, let's just take this and move this table back a little bit here. Here we have some liquid nitrogen. You can pick this up at, well you can't really pick this up anywhere actually. You have to have permits and whatnot, but uh, <laughs> we, we got some of it here. Just toss this aside here, and you might want to. What's step. the temperature of liquid nitrogen? Uh, by the way? It's like negative 197. Wow. So, uh, well, yeah, watch out there because it's going to burn your foot. I don't want my if shoe it, to if shatter. If it gets on your feet, it's going to freeze your toes, oh. and then if you try and move them, they break off. So you don't want to get it on your feet. Um, let's go ahead and pull out one of the. Uh, I put in a couple of bananas in there. Okay. Let's pull out. Let's the, get our you goggles, your goggles on, there. on. Okay, good. All right, you put. Pull that out. Set that. Yeah, there you go. Set that on the ground there. Uh, oh, oh yeah, you, you can see it's pretty much uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty much you can do it now. Pull out the hard drive, 
This one's been sitting here for a couple minutes, so we don't know if this is actually going to break the hard drive. We're not sure yet, but let's just give it a little. Oh! Yeah, it, it shatters. I don't know if that was so much a sledgehammer, but uh, it's. Um, you can see it's. Yeah, it was. A, it was an experiment. What are you going to do? But uh, six ways, six different ways to destroy all your data. All right, Marty, back to you. Well,